for us it's taking care of ourselves, taking care of, of our own performance and um, certainly we're going uh, to Bournemouth in, in, in good confidence. Dean, you were pleased that you got back into the game against Swansea City. How important is it to get some momentum against Bournemouth? Well, we want to get back to winning ways as quickly as possible. It was a good performance against Swansea. I thought we, we dominated the game really and, and, and just think weren't able to probably execute enough of our chances on, on the day but some of our approach play was outstanding and you know we had the lion's share of the possession against the Swansea team that, uh, that liked to have the ball and we forced them into lots of long balls and the pressing was good so it was a good performance and um, you know, it sets us up nicely now for this next game. It's a great game for us on, on Wednesday night, really can't wait for you know the opportunity to go and test ourselves against the team that were in the, the Premier League obviously not so long ago. I about to say two games in four, day, four days against teams who were in the Premier League, um, how much of an opportunity is this for you? It's always an opportunity, whoever you're playing against, but for sure the players want to test themselves against uh, against teams that have performed at a high level. For us, it's taking care of ourselves, taking care of, of our own performance. And um, as I say, we're you know, in a good position after the games that we've had previously. Um, we've picked up a few injuries, of course, so we have to manage that and uh, you know, we have to rotate the squad as we see fit. But certainly we're going uh, to Bournemouth in, in, in good confidence, good confident mood uh, and really can't wait for it. It is an intense period of games, uh, there's four in I think ten days, um, how important is the, the mental focus as well as the physical? The mental side of the game is massive, uh, I've, touched, I've touched on that many times previously, you know, in any situation and um, as you say there, it's, it's, it's more about focusing on the next one quickly, you can't really feel sorry for yourself for too long after a, a poor performance or a defeat and equally you can't get too high and you know, and, and be right up there after a win. It's about staying calm. It's a long season. We know that, and this is a real tough period in terms of uh, resources, in terms of the games coming. Um, but that's what squads about. That's what I've said before, and that's the reason that we're, we're working so hard on, on the team spirit uh, to, to get you through little periods like this. And uh, as I say, we're all quite calm. And um, as I say, just just looking forward to this next one. We're here today at Weston, and the wind's whipping off. Um, in terms of watching these games, how important is it for you and the other coaches? Yeah, it's extremely important and it's just great that we've got the opportunity to come here today and, and see this one. Um, you know, only last week we had 11 of the under-23s up at the training ground to, 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 you know, to, to, for a training session. Um, we've got a couple with us at the moment in the first team squad, so no, the, the, the pathway is clear. For, for young players at this football club, it's been there for a good long time now. The, the, there's a clear pathway and uh, it's important for myself to, to get eyes on, on these players and, and, and to show the interest. Uh, you never forget being a young player and, and seeing the first team staff around it, it really gives you a buzz and um, the boys are playing well today, it's been a good performance up to now, hopefully the same in the second half.